Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. My man Dan dug these up, and uh, I call these Punisher rackets, and these are tattoo rackets. <laughs> these are tattoo rackets. Let me put my arm on tattoos. Exactly. <laughs> Stay tuned. ball was in you cannot be serious you cannot be serious the ball hit the paint paint flew up did you not see that are you blind you need an eye doctor you cannot be serious oh wait i have swing vision the ball is in All right, so I seriously don't know much about these because I don't deal with these very much. They're called Prince Hydrogen Rackets, and it says it actually says tattoo on it. This is the 100 in the 290 gram version, unstrung. Dan has wait, the that's three, strong. Uh, oh, he couldn't two, see the strings. No, no, 290 oh, unstrung. Unstrung. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's 310 <laughs> unstrung. Unstrung. Um, <laughs> wait. So that's the heavier version. Yeah. My man Dan is a. Uh, is a fan of uh, what I call these Punisher rackets. Um, they are called Prince Hydrogen tattoo versions. So as you can see, it's tattooed. This is the 290 version unstrung. My man Dan has the 310 version unstrung. Now, what's with these rackets, my man Dan? So, here, hold that one. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. So I was looking at the, the Hydrogen website, uh, looking for a t-shirt a while back, maybe a couple of years ago, and I noticed these, these tennis rackets, and they're actually made by Prince. Hydrogen puts their brand on it, and they, they call it the tattoo, and I was so intrigued. Um, at the time, they only had the 290, the 310s were sold out, and so I thought I'd try one. Uh, I figured if it was too light, I could add some weight and stuff, um, but I was always intrigued by the, by the 310. Uh, so I, I tried that. I played with it. It was just a little too light. It didn't quite have the stability and mass that, that I was looking for. Um, what's cool about these rackets is uh, Power holes. the holes in there, which are really cool. They're, it makes the racket very aerodynamic through the air. It gives the string a lot of ability to move. It's a cool racket. It's a, it's a standard uh, Prince racket, actually. These tattoos, uh, and maybe you want to get a little bit of a, a close-up if you can, these are uh, apparently the actual tattoos on the all over the body of their uh, head of marketing, and so they decided <laughs> to put that on the on the racket. They have some newer versions of this racket. One's called a Chrome, um, and it's a, a Chrome kind of solid Chrome. And they have another one. I think it's called Splash or something. It's got like splatters of color on it. But I was always loving this uh, this tattoo style. I don't have any tattoos, but I'm thinking about it seriously oh. after this video. <laughs> um, and so I, I always wanted the 310. Uh, it, like I said, it was long sold out. I found some a place that had about six of them, still new. Um, they, they didn't charge an arm and a leg for them. And so I ordered uh, the 310 from the other place. You have to be careful when you order this stuff. If, if you read the fine print, it says that the dampener is not included. Oh. I thought the dampener was cool. I had to, you know, I got the racket without the dampener. I was disappointed. And they were sold out at the time, but I later found the, 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 the skull dampener that's so that's the coolest part of this racket it's the coolest part of the racket and i was like wow so now they're real clear in their website it's not included so i got the 310 um this is the factory string that it comes with oh the factory stencil uh i had restrung this a couple different times to you know mess around with it um so i did actually did the stencil on the outside to try to tr try to match this but i don't like paint on the string if i can avoid it mm. so i do have inverse stencil on that one got it uh, but we could try oh, these out got it all right so I mean, you know I like weight, so we're going to, let's go test them out. Sounds good.
All right, just got off the court. Tattoo, 100 from Prince, 290. You got the 310. Mm -hmm. I've tried the 290 before because you've lent it to me. The 310 is way better. Yeah, way better. <laughs> Why is it way better besides the weight? Is well, I, I think it's just the weight and the balance and the mass. Uh, it's just more mass on top, so it's easier to get power and control. Mm -hmm. I think this is a fantastic kind of uh, beginner intermediate kind of weekend racket. Uh, it, it's good with a slower swing speed. Mm -hmm. It's a really great control racket. When you start to pick up the pace, it's a little hard to control. Right. It's a little squirrely. This one's really solid. This is all the way up to a high level player can hit with this and it's uh, really fun to play with. Yeah, when you were hammering the balls at me, this, like when I try to rush the racket through to, to gain a little head speed, it actually didn't want to it right. was kind of fighting me yeah it, it kind of flopped at it, 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 it I, I couldn't like feel the racket um, come through in in the right way it's whereas like, yeah. Yeah. yeah whereas with the weight I actually can feel it and just kind of throw it at it and the weight actually kind of helped me launch it back at you yeah but um, yeah you can crush your ball with this thing yeah well, night is night and day I mean but but this is definitely meant for somebody with a more flat swing and uh, a little slower and swing slower speed. swing speed yeah. you know hopefully the ball is coming maybe a little slower too but um if you contact the heavy one the heavy one actually just shoots it way back there and um, it's and it's easy to control yeah both of the power levels according to prince is the same it's 875 is that a 875 yeah 875 yeah, yeah. Huh. well this is a lot more solid they don't make these anymore they make a it's the same racket in a different graphic. I think I mentioned that before. So no more tattoos or different tattoos? It's it's a, it's the same racket, but not with the tattoo. I see. They make a chrome and a spot. I think we talked about that. But yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. you can still find these out there. Um, it's a lot of fun if you, if you like tattoos. And uh, it's a really cool graphics on here. I just find myself staring at it. My partner's like, come on, can we play tennis now? I'm like, yeah, just a minute. <laughs> you should just put it on your arm and you can look at it all day. Yeah. I, I've got a friend who's a tattoo artist. Svetlio, we're going to tattoo one of these on my arm. Ooh. Tell me, tell me when you do it. Uh, no, all right. <laughs> Why do they call it Hydrogen? Well, that's the company. Oh, so it's oh, an oh. Italian company with this logo. Oh, I see. There's a company called Hydrogen. The website is Hydrogen IT. I see. And they do pickleball, tennis, apparel, rackets, bags. They really great products. Sometimes they come out with a new product, like they make a, a pickleball paddle. It's like $400. But you wait six months. And then they drop them like 50% off, 75% off, and then they discontinue them. So they're always coming out with new things. But it's a great company. Uh, the products are really neat. And uh, that's where I found it. Cool. Yeah, see, I don't know much about prints these days. I can't keep up with everybody. So yep. that's why I have my man, Dan. Yeah. <laughs> thank you, my man, Dan. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Thanks, right. thanks for inviting me. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis spin.